Hi guys and welcome to Unreal Engine C++ tutorial for beginners. This tutorial is very ideal for beginners. You will learn how to create a spinning cube like this using lines of codes. Okay guys, let's start a new tutorial. I'm going to select game and in here I will select blank, select C++ and the target environment that the platform that is going to be desktop and the quality is going to be maximum i want to leave this start starter content on and give the project a name i'm going to call it floating actor click on create there we go okay unreal engine is ready now so let's click on content run and right here you should be able to see your file c++ class you double click on the c++ class and you should be able to see the floating actor there so right click in here and let's select new c++ class there now we come right down here what we need is to select the actor this very one select the actor and click on next and let's give our actor a name i'm going to just call it floating actors and click on create there we go there i will now have our project called floating actor and i'm just going to close all these other files so that i don't get it mixed up now if we go to the Unreal Engine instruction here on C++ right here okay the instructions would like us to add the following lines of code right underneath the floating actor this is it here it's called U property visible anyway I want to copy that and let's go to our header file if you notice the system actually created cpp file and one other file for us okay so right there underneath here i am going to enter the copied lines of code right there this is where we've been instructed to add it okay now let's go back to the instruction online this url i'm going to include it on the description area for you guys to have a look at now the second thing here is number four okay now open up the floating actor dot cpp and right here are the following i want to grab them grab all of that and i'm going to come in here actor dot cpp that is where we are right underneath here that is where they want us to add our lines of code on these lines of code is going to be static construct helper f object finder if you want to know more about what they are referring to in there you can always press f1 to find out more about it and that is that done now let's see what other instruction do they want us to carry out let's come right down here now here right underneath where we have the tick that is the tick that we actually activate the whole system i'm going to grab they want us to add these lines of codes grab that and come right down here the tick is right here paste there you can individually find out or you can find out each of this instruction here okay if you are into C++ to find out what and what they meant to do like here you have create an uh, create an attaching component you can find out more about that you will see it all on the line just click on it and open it up okay you can open it on a separate page if you want so I've saved that I'm gonna save this cpp as well that is saved as you can see there's no error so let's build it up okay build so far no error is popping out yet 
is the building. There, I'm saying one succeeded. Okay, in that case, let's just see what's going to happen. So I'm going to save and let's click on run. All right, that is opening up Unreal Engine for us now, where we will go and carry out the other enhancement. Okay, that opens up the Unreal Engine development environment. So what we want to now do is I'm going to first of all open up my world outliner and just right click and click on restore and I'm going to repeat the same thing for details. There we go, I need both of those. So let's go into content drawer here inside your cpp you should be able to see your file floating actor double click on it and that is our program right there okay the actor grab the actor hold and drag drop it right there there we go that is the actor right there okay so let's see what is what else we meant to do so according to the instruction i meant to drag the cube right on board let's go there that is it done now if you come right down here you want us to set the location minus 180 by 180 i'm going to minimize that make sure it's selected come in here you see where we have transform and let's change this to minus 180 by 180 here by 180 press enter and there we go look at that so what else are we meant to do before we run this program let's come right down here all we then need to do is just run the program here is an example of what the program is meant to do if you click on it you will see this cube doing its own thing so let's run our own program and see what's going to happen click on run or play click on play there we go look at that you see that guys you see that that is what that very lines of code does okay i guess you guys enjoy it and if you want to see how it's the final their own final product this is their own final product right they have just clicked on it and that is it exactly what is meant to do so I'm going to include this URL into my description area so that you guys can have a go at it. So with that guys, I'm going to call it the end of this brief tutorial. Let's collapse this, move to the sidebar. I suppose you guys enjoy it. And please do subscribe to the channel. And for your information, there's going to be more tutorials using C++ in Unreal Engine. Thanks for watching and bye for now.